Hello, I'm Dr. Jeffrey Britton. I'm an epilepsy physician at Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. Um, I primarily uh, care for adults with uh, epilepsy. Today I would like to talk about uh, the first seizure. Now, what is the overall risk of having more seizures if you've had a first seizure? Um, Long-term studies have shown uh, that if a person has a first seizure, all temporary conditions have been ruled out or corrected for. Um, and if you decide not to treat, the risk of another seizure happening within the next two to five years ranges from 30 to 50 percent. So if your glass is um, half full, you could say that's a 50 to 70 percent risk or chance that a seizure will not happen. Um, those, there are factors that help tell us who is most likely to be part of the 30 to 50 percent who will have a seizure. Patients who have a known lesion on MRI, patients who upon neurologic examination have abnormalities on their physical examination, um, those who had their first seizure upon awakening in the morning, um, those persons are at Great, or, or the seizure arose out of sleep, uh, those patients are at higher risk of having further seizures in the future. So one might choose to initiate treatment in that setting. Um, not having those risk factors doesn't mean you're out of the, out of the woods and won't have a seizure, uh, but it does mean your risk is perhaps a little bit less. So. Those factors should be weighed in making a decision about treatment. So to summarize, um, seizures are common. Every person can have a seizure under the right circumstances or wrong circumstances, if you will. Um, about 5% will have, of people will have a seizure in their lifetime. Not everybody who has a seizure has epilepsy. Uh, in fact, uh, really uh, a minority of people who have a single seizure will end up having what we call epilepsy. Those after a first seizure, it's important you seek prompt uh, medical uh, evaluation, um, a careful review of medications taken, other common medical conditions should be done to look for other explanations other than epilepsy as a cause of the seizure. Tests should be considered, including Beyond any, any blood tests that your healthcare provider thinks are necessary, include uh, he, uh, imaging of the brain, such as a CAT scan or MRI, and an EEG. Then the person's unique circumstances need to be taken into account in the context of the risk of having further seizures uh, before making a final uh, treatment decision as to whether to start a medication uh, or not. Thank you.